if you talk about do we need more money or not, we should look left and right. And I would like to cite the example of the state of Singapore. They have similar projects, five years planned, and they've just decided to rise the budget there by 20%. So if we really want to be competitive in Europe, it is necessary, there's a necessary condition to have sufficient means. It is a necessary condition in the mathematical terms, it's not a sufficient condition. And I completely concur with what Alessandro said. The second condition that makes it a little bit more sufficient is to have out open borders, flowing of people, tracking the talented, the most talented people in the world. And I would like to add a third ingredient to that soup, and that is the autonomy of the research institutions. I think if we put together these three things, sufficient resources, open boundaries, and the autonomy of those institutions that have to carry out the results, we have a good chance to be there where the rest of the world is and where the rest of the world needs to be to win this race. Now about the basic funding, that it is an uh, old dilemma. How do you explain to a politician that he or she has to invest a lot of money into something that might be a failure? But if you don't take these risks, you will never have these breakthroughs that we are looking for. Uh, you cited Einstein, and let me use that example. Einstein in the year 1905 published four papers, two of which <coughs> made a big contribution. One was of the electric effect, the photoelectric effect, the other one, other one was on the special relativity. Without the explanation of the photoelectric effect, we wouldn't have solar panels today. So all of this COP21 uh, yeah. energy transition without that weird guy in some obscure Bernese uh, patent office having these ideas, we wouldn't have that. Okay, but what do you say when a politician says, yeah, yeah, I know, it's important, but we'll, pay it, we'll do it next year, not this year? <laughs> <laughs> Then I'm telling him or her, if you do it next year, this year somebody else will do it and they will have the benefits in 20 years down the road. And you will be completely out of business. 